On April 18, 1943, while poaching in Hagleywood, England, four boys discovered skeletal remains in a tree. But how they got there is truly a mystery. I'm Paul on behalf of Graveyard Shift, and this is the puzzling story of Hagley Woods' skeletal remains. Thinking though which elm tree would serve as a good place to hunt for bird nest, one of the boys, Bob Farmer, climbed up the tree to check it out. As he was climbing, he found a hollow opening in the tree's trunk. Wedged tightly inside was a woman's skeleton, almost complete, except for a missing hand. Terrified, the boys swore a pact of silence and fled. But the youngest of the boys, Tommy Willets, was so traumatized, he informed his parents of their discovery. While investigating, the police found the woman's severed hand buried nearby, which gave rise to speculation she suffered a black magic execution in which its covens and Satanists were operating in the local area. Now, after police analysis, the bones were determined to belong to a woman aged 35 to 40 who was placed still warm into the tree where she remained hidden for at least 18 months. Adding to the already baffling mystery, locals named the unidentified woman Bella after graffiti began appearing across the region. Reading, who put Bella down the witch elm? The graffiti suggests someone must have known more than they were letting on. However, no one came forward with any information. Whatever the truth, Bella's identity and murder to this day remain unsolved. I'm Paul on behalf of Graveyard Shift, and this is the mysterious story of who put Bella in the witch elm.